welcome back to my channel. Okay guys, so today I'm gonna be walking my sister through doing her full face of makeup and have you ever done full well, no right? Like not full not, full not face. myself now. I've Never. done her makeup before and she can do her makeup, but I, I'm gonna walk her through and uh, we're gonna do the makeup exactly. She's gonna do it exactly like I do, right? Mm -hmm. We should do an exact look. Mm -hmm. So yeah. Mm -hmm. And hopefully this will help some of you guys that want to know how to do your makeup because I'm gonna and teach you, you her. can do it. And yeah. Uh, I am yeah. the perfect example of somebody who's never done some of this stuff and you know and how you can actually yeah. do it. Learn. Yeah. Yeah, learn. And I mean it's not that you don't know how to do your makeup. It's just no. yeah. Alright guys, so we're gonna go ahead and get started and like I said I'm just gonna walk her through. And the first thing you have to do is moisturize. Mm -hmm. Always. Hey. I'm all. <laughs> Alright. Moisturize. So. so like usually, this one, whichever, <laughs> like just a little bit. It's not easy. And you want to do it like 10 minutes before, but it doesn't matter. This I actually did now. moisturize it this morning, yeah, but okay. it sucks in in my skin, yeah. so I... I'm dry, like, so... Like really bad? Yeah, me too. A lot of people wait to do it, like they moisturize and then they wait 10 minutes and then do their makeup. But it's up to you. I'm putting like a lot of it. Alright, and then you're going to do primer. Face primer, I use one. This is, I'm gonna be using the L'Oreal Magic Lumi. And, well, here I'll give it to you. Yeah. I'm all like, just a little bit. Okay. Oh, like in this. I'm all gonna. <laughs> no, I'm like. Kind of too. And then just put it like in the center of your face. Kind of, um, you see? Mm -hmm. Like, got it. Okay. And like, usually, well, usually primers are like pore minimizers, but this one's just like, um, it makes, it has an illuminator. Yeah, just rub it. Next foundation, you just have to find your shade. I think this one's yours. Yeah, I'm pretty yeah, sure. Yeah, that looks like it. Mm -hmm. This is the, she's gonna use the EX1, and you can mix them to make your own shade, and we'll mix, we'll mix both of them. So we're gonna use Milani 2 Natural, so you can just pump some on the back of your hand, mm -hmm. and then kind of mix them with your finger. Uh -huh. This is a full coverage, and we're gonna be using um, Beauty Sponges, I only have one of the real techniques, so I'm gonna let her use this one. And you want it, but then you just dot it on your face. Okay, so I just what? Dot um, this? No, just dot it on your face with your finger first. Okay. <laughs> you know, like, so oh, like the, and there's the no one that needs help. There's no one, but like it's funny. No, but I want to do it the way you do because I want you to do it exactly. I'm like, no, no, no. Yes, exactly. No, I want. That's what I want. But it's okay. It's funny. Okay. Okay. So then just dot it all over your okay, face. Okay. Like, so. you know, like even not evenly. It doesn't matter. Just dot it. <laughs> La Cruz. No, I'm kidding. Kidding. No, I'm <laughs> I know what I usually do, but I'm like, yeah. Right now I'm like lost and like, no. <laughs> just I want to watch what you're doing. And there's a lot of steps. You're gonna be like, what the hell? No, and that's what I want to do. It's yeah. But the results are so it's freaking fun. awesome. Like I want to see if like yeah, how exactly. Yeah. Cool. Okay. And then just blend it out. Like act like I never do this. I'm like, <laughs> this no. is so dumb. Okay, look. Okay. You see, you just start patting. Okay. Like don't like rub, never spread. Yeah. Okay. Never spread. Always pat. Pat. Damn. Pat. Damn. Damn. How does it go? Damn. Was that? Oh. <laughs> and this takes forever because like you want to dab it uh -huh. and look at like on the side of your nose. Like make sure to get in there uh -huh. at this point. Because that's, that's annoying. Like Spot. everywhere. Little red vessel. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All of that. Cool. Mm -hmm. Really, you know me, right? And really like, like it. I really don't do it. Yeah. But I love how it looks. Yeah, it looks, well, this is what makes it look flawless. Yeah. Like a sponge. Yeah. And just, yeah, just pop. Yeah, well, I guess because yeah. I would always use that little wedge. Yeah. You know, like and that just grew up. That one is no, not, but you have to tap it. Works. Kind of yeah, but you, if you don't know what to do yeah. with it. Yeah. I guess there's like different techniques. Mm hmm. How much I can use, like. I know, right? Let me see, sister. <laughs> <laughs> no, <it's been> <laughs> control, control, control. <laughs> now you're good. I want to. I like the spine, like just a new, like it has a little knob. Yeah, I, I said I like that one, but this one's for highlight, highlighting and contouring. Now it makes sense. I'm on yeah, what was right? that for? The yeah. shape, yeah. Well, it's actually it's a new sponge, and this one's like you contour with it, uh -huh. and then this one you highlight. Oh, okay. Cream, but oh. I don't. I haven't tried it like that. Yep, and just like always, like in the mirror, like look, you know, just like look mm -hmm. good, and you're good. Yeah, feels good. Yeah, blended. And that's where like I used to just like do it quick and then like I don't know like I guess because I'm pa like real real patient I'm always like yeah. Well, you want to do it good? Yeah. yeah, but it's not that serious. I, no, I'd be doing that too. I was like, should I stop? Because mm -hmm. I think I shouldn't. Yeah. <laughs> 
All right, next we're gonna do concealer, and this is my favorite one, um, Age Rewind. And if you want, you can. You have it? Yeah, I have a big one. Okay. Do you want to use a sponge? Yeah, if not, I will rip up the sponge. No, no, let me go get it. Like, I don't want to use that. And that's foundation. What's that? The concealer. I pump it and put it on the back of my hand. Okay. See? So like no germs. I don't want to force you to no, put I don't germs. But just a little bit and then mm -hmm. watch if it looks pretty good. Nice. Mm -hmm. And you, okay, now we're going to go under the eye in a triangle. You see, look, watch it. Oh, okay. Up, next to the nose and then just, you don't want to go too far out because then it makes your face look bigger. Mm, no. You know? Mm -mm. And if you want to look bigger, then put it out here, but like no. right under the eye like this. And then just get in there. And then I put this one on my eyelid too, so like to prime my eyes. Like all the way in here? Yeah, look, you see, look, look at me, like all oh, okay. up in here. Like go like this, you, you look okay. away, and you go like that. And then okay. just drag it into a triangle. <laughs> oh, let's do singing, <laughs> Little Mermaid. <laughs> if you, like, yeah, if you just want to like get it in there, and then you can use a sponge if you want to like get in there, like mm -hmm. to the corner, this one's good for that. Did I so you too much? No, you're good. Just keep on blending it. Mm -hmm. But you could um, use this right now mm -hmm. and start like blending it more. I can't believe how good it disappears. That's so right? weird. Yeah. Yeah, like, it just it sinks in. Like yeah. You don't think you're like, oh my God, like that's too much. Scary part. Yeah. yeah like. And just make sure. The main important thing is that you blend. Like you blend mm -hmm. it in, and you're good. And before I never used to like I used to put my foundation on and you wouldn't blend, so you look weird and streaky. Mm -hmm. It's all about uh, the technique. Yeah, and that's why. Okay, then like the rest of the concealer, I always put it like in a triangle on my forehead. But you don't have to, you can just like dab it right here in the middle. Because mm -hmm. you want it like where all the light, like I highlight with it too. Like, so, like on the down here and then up. Yeah, like just right here in this area. Mm -hmm. Put some there, put some on your chin. I put some on the sides of my mouth because it's dark right there. Mm -hmm. So just, and that's pretty much okay. where you want it. And then just blend it in. I'm excited to see the end. Like I know. To see how teaching somebody to do it themselves will work. Mm -hmm. and that's why I always like. Usually, I like to conceal my under eye, mm -hmm. and then before I put powder on it, I make sure there's no lines, it's like little lines. You know, you can rub it out again with your the one under your eyes, not mm -hmm. like your forehead or anything like that. Now we're gonna set the under eyes and the face, and we're gonna use Cody Airspun. It's a powder. Mm -hmm. So this one I only use for under the eyes mm -hmm. or in the sides of the nose. So this is what I do. You grab a little sponge. Okay. And then it's always wet. It's so cute. And you just put it in the powder. Like we're gonna bake. I'm gonna teach you how to bake. So you like completely make sure you get a good like just shove it in there. Make sure to look under your eyes and if there's creasing, do mm -hmm. it with this again. Like just blend it out. And if not, you can do this one. So like, okay. right now mm -hmm. you have your powder, and then you just go like just this. You're gonna just go straight in there mm -hmm. and just go right under the eye like that. Okay. Like just completely co cover your concealer and tap it in. The reason why you put like extra powder is when you do your eyeshadow mm -hmm. and there's fallout and it falls under your eyes, mm -hmm. you just sweep it away and like, oh, okay. and then it helps your concealer set. So like you're like just, preparing extra, it, like you're baking the base. It. Yeah. Set the concealer and your concealer is not going to crease all day. Okay. That's pretty much why. Yeah, because it's. And then you get more powder, and then I go on the sides of like in that crease mm -hmm. in there, like just under on the sides of the nose and it can look all crazy you can use the powder okay then we're gonna set the face and just using a regular pressed powder so you can it's they're both transparent so we're just using a flat top brush and then this powder you just pat it again you pat it everywhere else like under the eyes you don't have to worry about because you already did no no you jacked this up my, my sponge was too wet and you can help blend away that those edges like don't yeah, just, you know, like blend away that powder that you mm -hmm. did. All over? Yep. And like right now, like you're setting the foundation, like you're, mm -hmm. you're blank and you're all white and crazy looking mm -hmm. and then you add the color and oh, you okay. add, you know, everything else. Oh, okay. Contra bronzer, bronzer. Okay. <laughs> no, I'm like, okay. I'm all lost. Yeah, we're going to use Hula Bronzer by Benefit. And this is with a fluffy brush. Because this one, like, you want a light hand. You don't want to push hard. Because okay. this is going to be, like, just a, like, Quick on your contour area. Yeah. yeah. We're, like, so right here, mm -hmm. like, just straight up and down. Okay. Go there first. 
Like in little circular motions, like just go like this. Oh. Under your chin. Uh -huh. And like right here, like the jawline, you see how it's darker right here? Mm -hmm. Like I like to just sweep it like that. Okay. And okay. you do both. Just, just like, like, like in your cheek? Yeah, so when you suck in your cheek lip, this is what you're gonna do. You're only gonna go from the hairline, like about to here. You don't wanna go right down. above like that ear, right? Yep. No. Just like right there. You don't wanna go all the way down because it's gonna like make dark this area. You don't wanna like, dark. So you don't see? And if you want, like if you want, this is what people do when they wanna clean get powder. And you see that line? Like the bottom. Mm -hmm. See what oh, I did? Yeah. I just laid the and then it's gonna when I sweep that away, see how it makes my line yeah. sharper? Mm -hmm. Like it just cleans it up. Just the bottom? Yeah. Yep, just like that. And you can blend it more like with the sponge and more, yeah. Like, well let's do blush next. Mm -hmm. So whatever blush you wanna use, um, Romantic rose, just like a light blush. Like, you're gonna want to focus it up here, like drop off the powder up here. Okay. And this, like, here's your contour, mm -hmm. here's your highlight, where, what you did, center. and just right here in the center, okay. up into the hairline, mm -hmm. and start blending it. Okay. Here, and just bring it down as much as you want. Like, I like to do the apples of the cheeks, but you could just keep it up here. Like, I like how it looks, just like this. All right, then we do highlights. And highlight, um, you can use this brush, Gilded Honey by Laura Geller. This is a pretty one. Gilded it's, Honey sounds it's pretty. It's so pretty. <laughs> Look at that. Ooh, oh, nice. So pretty. I love this one. So you just, I like to put a lot. So mm -hmm. you do however you want. Like just. Well, I'm sure I like it too. Yeah. You see where you highlighted the concealer? Mm -hmm. Same place. You're just gonna do this. Like literally, like. Pause your hand mm -hmm. and just like brush just it on. That's where your natural your wrist. We're natural. And yeah, maybe it'll see. Like, if you see how I have my hand, like yeah. That? yeah. And usually, with the light hand, the lighter the hand, it'll blend easier. Okay, just imagine a line like a line right here. I just go, oh, down, okay, yeah, okay. like straight, <laughs> whatever that is. Sus. And then, always the tip of the nose, like just barely your tip of the nose, like that. And then, right here, right between your eyes, just touch it. Wet it and then let it dry and let it soak in. And you're sealing everything in. Mm -hmm. We have to use the angled brush. Mm -hmm. And then we're using that Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade Dark Brown. And so I'm going to show you how I do it really quick this tail. Like I have the brush fully loaded. And then, you know, always imagine a line under your brow mm -hmm. and on top. I brush, you want the most product at the end. So I just go in. You see? I go in the middle of the brow mm -hmm. completely, like just messily in there. And I then I start worrying about like the top, you see? Mm -hmm. I want to keep it so thin on the end. Yeah. So watch. Like, you can mm -hmm. see. Like, do you see your eyebrow? Yeah. You see how... <laughs> <laughs> the, the dumb response. Yeah. And keep it yeah. in the lines. <laughs> Look how you're in. Yeah. <laughs> so go more down. Like, go in. Okay. Okay. Yep. And then all the way to the tail. So you gotta, yeah. And you'll learn, like, you'll just learn how to be a little more light-handed or that, you know, like, you'll know what's smart. Know what's smart. I'm not mad first. Jerry. Oh, fuck. That's what it's supposed to look. Okay, this is what you do right now. Get the brush. <laughs> It's it's funny. Get the brush and brush out a little bit. Oh, I don't want to hurt. All that. So just. <laughs> it doesn't. It's funny because that's how brows are. Like uh, they're freaking crazy. Uh -huh. Okay, and just <laughs> brush it in with the brush. But going. Yeah. <laughs> it's yeah, difficult. I oh, sorry. No, it's fine. No, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Later, later. Later. I'm gonna clean this eyebrow, and you can just watch me really quick. You see how it's like not shaped? Mm -hmm. You just pretty much go in, put the line, you know, mm -hmm. you see? And then with your finger, you don't want to touch your eyebrow. With your finger, blend in the concealer. Mm -hmm. So draw it under. Yeah. And try not to get into your brow. Yeah. I think I did. And just like angle the brush down so you're not touching the hairs, you know? Like, there you go. You see how, and then just stop and with your finger, blend it in. Tap it in. Okay, um, then eyelid primer. We're gonna do the eyes. Okay. So, same concealer, or you can use the eye base, but I like this one. The same thing, like setting it. 
Mm -hmm. I've been baking my eyes, that's pretty much what I've been doing. Like, this is what it's called, baking your eyes. And when you put eyeshadow, it's easy to blend. Mm -hmm. So we're going to go into like a light shade. The light shade is what you want to do first. So both? So yeah. We're just mixing two light shades. And they're going to be your transition because any colors you're going to go on top with, these are going to be like the bronzer mm -hmm. of the face, you know, like yeah. just mapping out where you're going to... Okay, start always, leave the product on the end of your eye, mm -hmm. and then just sweep it in. And like it. With the light hand. Get in there and just blend it. Like try to like, just very light hand. On the like, whole Like use eye? the tip of the brush. Yeah, okay, and just leave it on the edge. You're doing really good. It looks like really good. good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you put a little too much where it went, you made it into your crease. Mm -hmm. But you have big creases. Like, I don't have any crease. Like, where our eyes are different. Mm -hmm. that yeah. One. You have a lid. So it actually works fine for you. Like me, I have to do the whole fake the crease. Mm -hmm. It's like here, this area. Mm -hmm. Just that you little see? corner. The little corner. Yeah, because I and you're gonna going to brush it in. Deep, like a you deep see? Spot you're going to brush it in. You want to <laughs> put the eyeshadow in your outer V. And just pretty much blending it in like this. Look. Because you want to get more depth in your eyes, so you're just going to focus there. Yeah. Oh. I don't know. You got it. I think because I didn't do the V very well. Mine are going to look way different because my V goes downward. You're going to go into this darker shade. Mm -hmm. And then just you're going to stamp it again. See how on the outer corner? Mm -hmm. Just focuses it right there. Like not too. You want to make depth. So you just go like that. In, but like I want to show you how you keep it all in the outer corner. Yeah, very outer corner. Let me see. <laughs> okay, now that I love color, what color do you want? Old pink. You can use cranberry orange. Ooh. You can use this one. This one's a pretty orange mm -hmm. color. So go in there, mm -hmm. press it in, and just pretty much like blend it with your finger. Okay, inner corner, and just like look in the bigger mirror, you can see like the shimmer. Now the lower lash line, you don't have to, but like I pretty much do the same thing I did to the top, mm -hmm. but no shimmer. So like, look. Okay. See how it looks like really just like mm. you did good. Dang. <laughs> Dang. Yay. Okay, so what do you want? Do you want the liquid? Do you want the pin or do you want gel? Um, what do you think? And you see how I'm messing up there, but that's okay. Like, I'm just worried about the wing. Mm -hmm. Okay, now I got that and I go inwards. Okay. And you're gonna have to focus on like this top line. Now eyelash time, so just put a coat of mascara. Do you have mascara? Okay. So she's gonna be using the Kiss Vamp lashes. With the tapered in. Show like the babies, yeah. Mm -hmm. I put it where I want it, I grab this corner, and I put it where I want it. Okay, and then so I press it like this. See? Mm -hmm. So that's... <laughs> good. Mm -hmm. okay, good. Good. And then um, now you can, is when you can do the eyeliner. Mm -hmm. So now? Yep, we did. Mm -hmm. Just get in there and try to fill them Okay, now the lips. What color do you want to do? Your... Like, do you oh, like okay. how it looks? Mm -hmm. I like how it looks. Mm -hmm. It looks good. It looks like the bronzy eye with the purple lip. Looks good. Mm -hmm. I actually tried that color yesterday. I was gonna wear it to work. <laughs> cool. Okay. <laughs> Drying. <laughs> I know. All right, guys. So she did this on her own. Do you, what do you think the? Let's ask a couple questions. What do you think the hardest part was? Like what? eyebrows. Eyebrows. Oh yeah, <laughs> for sure. Just not hard, but more They're tricky. Difficult. Like, yeah. yeah. Just it can be fixed. But they look though. good. You're mm -hmm. so good. And they look good dark and like filled in and just mm -hmm. good. And what did what was your favorite part about it? Um 
Finding out that the foundation and highlighter and everything that you put on is yeah, not so like hard. Yeah, the face. It's not like so hard. The face, yeah. no. Like, I was really afraid. It was scary in the, yeah. like, it looks crazy in the beginning, right? Mm -hmm. like, it looks yeah, crazy. it makes you think, oh, and you're then now, wrong, like, and look, then... it looks good. It looks yeah. seamless. Like, it looks all put together. Mm -hmm. Everything goes together. Yep. When you do full face, you need eyelashes, eyebrows, like, everything just, just goes together. Just give it a try, because... Uh, Me, I like how yeah. you did your eyes so easy. Yeah. <laughs> and they look so good. I love... This is like the first time putting my own makeup on, just like oh, Velma does. First time, so the very first time. Not I've never practiced at home, nothing. It's the very first time, oh. and it came out like this. So just follow her tutorials, <laughs> and you can do it. Just if you think you can't, I'm like the worst one for makeup. So oh, no. no, I never do it. So it looks good. It's not like I oh practice, guys. So let us know what video you want to see from us next, mm -hmm. and thank you for watching. Bye. Bye.